We are live! Alright, here we go. This is a man, his T's representing for the Three Pointers TV uh, Arsenal fan view. I've got my man, Marty. Yeah, man, we're back, man. And we're I've back. got little Honey. Show us your shirt. Just the shirt, 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 man. There you go. There you go. There you go, man. Listen, let's get straight into it. Martin, man, what did, what did you think of the game today, man? I think, I think it was a really good performance. I mean, look, it was it was a bit bitty in in bits. And the thing, the thing with it was, I think that's a game, again, that we would have lost a season, two seasons ago, three seasons ago, without a doubt. That was a, it was a hard-fought win in the end. And what I love is how we respond. We went, we went one all, and then we responded straight away. And what a, what a goal through Martinelli. Absolutely phenomenal. That guy was running the ground all game. Absolutely on fire. He was just driving it and pushing it from midfield, picking up the ball, pushing it through. He's phenomenal. And the one thing I will say as well, I don't know what it is about our ex-goalkeepers that come to the Emirates, <laughs> the, the, uh, Arteta flogs. And then, um, and then they come here and they gift us a goal. That Martinez, you'd put your house that he wouldn't do it. But funny enough, he did it last season. So last season, he's done exactly the same thing, pretty much. And then, then just literally tonight, which has gifted us a goal. But he pulled out a couple of world-class saves. One, which he picked it out the top corner, which was a ball that if, I, I can't believe he saved it. Got to, got literally, got the hand to it, put it over the top. Uh, and he did another one as well in the um, in the second half near the end. Unbelievable! He had, you know he had a really good game. He did command his area, but in bits he just he just faltered. And that was that was exactly where it went. That was, that was yeah. exactly where it ended up going. But one thing I love about the Emirates at the moment: this is the first time, and maybe a lot of younger um, fans won't remember. This is the first time this place starts to feel like Highbury. That, that atmosphere, that raucous atmosphere where everyone's on fire and everyone's getting electric and everyone's off of their seat and everyone's everyone's moving and shouting the songs, the chants, everything's coming out. Yeah. It's great mate, it was a great evening and what, what a fantastic evening as well it was, it was beautiful weather and then to come here, a clear, a clear lovely evening at the Emirates and watch a game of football like that and, and, and to go, I mean the excitement of obviously going 1-0 up, then 1-0 and then, then winning 2-1. I, I think sometimes those games can be better than the four nil drubbins or the three nilers, uh, you know, as secure as they are and as great as they are. But it was a good game. It was good fun. Unfortunately for Steven Gerrard, I think he could well be on the way out. I think if any manager is going to go next in the Premier League, his run of form has been absolutely terrible. And if you look at his statistics, his statistics are some of the worst in the Premier League um, and in form wise. And I don't know how he's been in a job so long. And especially a big club like Aston Villa, they're going to be looking to potentially move him on. And Listen, on. Marty, um, still top of the table. We've got a big game against Man United on Sunday, four o'clock kickoff. How do you feel about, about us going into that game with the, with the injuries with Partey and um, El Nenny? You know, do you reckon like players like Lokonga can sort of handle the pressure of going to Old Trafford and maybe doing the business? Well, the, th the, th the, thing, the thing with Lokonga is he came in tonight and he did do a job. OK, it is against the Aston Villa side that have been getting knocked around, but you know, from what I saw, his ball control and how he spread the play, he was really, he was decent and he slotted in well and he played well with Xhaka. The, the, old, tra the old Trafford game is always going to be a, a tough game. Always has been for years, even when United ain't been for on form. And like I said in the original video, it looks like United now are starting to find a bit of form. They've brought in a couple of players, uh, a couple of decent players, and, and it looks like their, their fortunes have, re have reversed. He's, he's, he's hooked off Maguire and Ronaldo, and it looks to have done a bit of a number on them. And, and it's going to be, you know, going to Old Trafford, 75,000, it's going to be an atmosphere. It's going to be, you know, two teams. Obviously, we're at the top. They're going to be looking to get the first, you know, the, the, the winner against us and like they did obviously in the 49 of the 49 games that's where we lost it at Trafford exactly. so it, it's going to be it's going to be an interesting especially the four o'clock kickoff on a Sunday what you know it's what Sunday afternoons are about right okay, yeah. well, absolutely um, I also wanted to ask you well let's let's go to honey let's ask honey how did you how did you feel going into this game how did you feel good yeah what was your what was your um, score prediction? 4-1. Uh, oh, 4-1, yeah? Very ambitious. Are you liking the way Arsenal are playing right now? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Who's your, fa your favourite player? Who's, who's been your best player this season so far? Um, I'm not sure. You're not sure? 
Go on, like, go on. We're gonna give her. We're gonna give her ten seconds. Ten seconds to guess. Thank Jesus. Thank Jesus. Thank Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. Um, I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, are you are trying you? to get her to say Jesus? <laughs> <laughs> it's like trying to get a rocking horse to do a thing. <laughs> oh bless! Oh look, look at you there, man. Um, where, where do you reckon we're gonna finish this season? Are we gonna win the league? Are we gonna yes. win it? Is it too early to say? A little bit too early. Come on, peeps! What are you waiting for? Like, share, subscribe to the free pointers.